shots, and it always sounds like fireworks. So it kind of just goes over my head, and I just ignore it because it's so frequent. To help combat that problem, just yesterday the Omaha Police Department announced, with the help of private donors, the rewards for good information leading to arrests in shootings or homicides have been increased to ten and twenty-five thousand dollars. Taking a step back to 1998 and 99, banks in Omaha were increasingly becoming the target of robberies. To help that, the incentive for good information on arrests was increased as well, and that seemed to help buck the trend. Today, we checked on the progress of the latest addition to reward money over the past 24 hours. We had a few tips come in, but those tips were very detailed and had a lot of good information that may actually uh, lead out to a solid arrest. That's the type of tip that we would pay on. Officer James Shade says a key aspect of the program is letting tipsters know they will remain anonymous no matter what. Even the phone line where the calls come in displays nothing about that caller. Comfort for Reed, who believes the risk may be too high for some. If you get found out that you snitched, you would be in a whole lot of deep stuff with a whole lot of bad people. I let everybody know, not only do I not have your name and phone number, but I would lose a case before I would ever let a tipster be known.